Hello, guys. It's Nato Ace. And this time, I want to give my thoughts on something that was revealed during Tokyo Game Show 2019 for the PlayStation 4. And that is the future of Yokai Watch. Well, in Japan, and to some extent, worldwide. So, if you've been following Tokyo Game Show 2019, PlayStation just revealed. Yokai Watch 4, actually, finally, for the first time, going to a PlayStation platform. Yokai Watch games was never, ever been in a Sony platform. It was always starting at 3DS. And of course, the fourth one went to the Switch because you can kind of see what's happening. The 3DS, well, it's dying. It's more of a portable game. So, what is Yokai Watch? It's sort of Pokemon, but with Yokai, Oni, Spirit, Demon, that's what it is. It's a kid's show in Japan, they love this type of fairy tale. And the backstory with Yokei Watch, believe it or not, when the first Yokei Watch ever came in Japan, not a lot of kids like it to a point that they have to do a anime all about Yokei Watch. Sounds familiar? Definitely. Pokemon did the same thing also. The first Pokemon, red and green, yes, green, not blue. Kids didn't understand it. They later on with an anime, some of the kids said, oh, that's what Pokemon is, and there you go. So, same goes with Yokai Watch. However, the downside now is that apparently for each version of Yokai Watch, well, the popularity is going downward. And apparently, now there have been reports that Yokai Watch 4 for the Switch in Japan didn't do good. To a point that now they're considering moving it to the PlayStation 4 as well. And of course, in America, it's already been announced that Yokai Watch. Four will also go outside of Japan 2020. And of course, if you've been wondering, wait a minute, your Play Watch is going to the PlayStation 4, but isn't that a Nintendo published game? Only in America. There are some situations where Nintendo of America published the game in order to, well, localize it, put in the money because the company themselves won't do it. Case in point Dragon Quest 7 and Dragon Quest 8. In Japan, it was actually, believe it or not, published by Square Enix. But people wanted it. We want this new Dragon Quest. Can you please bring it outside? Square Enix said, Well, if it doesn't sell, we don't want to use some money. You want this game? So they had a talk with Nintendo. So Nintendo said, Okay, outside of Japan, we'll publish the game. And they've been doing it for some other games too. Believe it or not. In the case with Ninja Gaiden. At some point, yeah, they did it for the Nintendo Wii U. And then, of course, if you heard about it, Dragon Quest XI has reasons why published by Nintendo because Square Enix didn't want to port the game on the Switch unless someone else funded the money. I know Square Enix sounds like assy and selfish, but whatever, it's a business. So, back to Yokai Watch. So, what does it mean? Is it finally time for Yokai Watch to go down? Throwing the towel? Well, maybe, maybe not. Here's the thing if this game, Japan for now, doesn't sell Yokai Watch 4, well, that's it. I think that's the end of the Yokai Watch series. Oh man, so, and here's the funny part. Like I said, in Japan, you get away with it because Level 5 can actually publish his game themselves. Remember, they publish their own games. So, yeah, this is a little bit of response to Spinewood because he was wondering, all right, well, who's going to publish y o k a y Watch for the PlayStation 4? Well, here's my theory. One, in Japan, it's probably going to be, of course, Level 5, they'll publish your own game. y o k a y Watch published by Level 5. No big deal there. Okay, what about outside of Japan? That's the question. Who is going to publish it? There is no publishing team for Level 5. That's not a joke. There is no. Publishing team. Yeah, there is a US division level 5, but they don't have a publishing license. They can't publish anything outside of Japan. Could it be Sony? Then does that mean Sony's gonna put in the money? Is it gonna be Miss America? Could it be Axie? Axie Games? Could it be whoever? Will this game be dubbed? Who's gonna fund the game? So that's an interesting part there. Will it even come out of Japan, outside of Japan? That's another question there. So it is really interesting that Yokai Watch is going to be on the PS4 for now in Japan. I don't know if it's going to go outside of Japan. And then my people say, well, 
Nintendo Yoke Watch a portable game, so why would I want to play this on the PS4 versus on the Switch? That's true, because the Switch has something good that the PS4 doesn't have. Able to play retail exclusive experience games on the go. What do you have for the PlayStation 4? Maybe Pro Enhanced 4K. You can see Jubanya Nate on 4K. Trophies. Now I'm just going to have trophies. And I, I keep telling people this. I keep telling Nintendo, put trophies on the Switch. People will be happy. But sadly, as of right now, they're not doing it. And I know I'm going to be a broken record once again. I saw that's what d is for. Trophy. Online and trophy. But whatever. Sony has trophy support. Achievement. 4K. Able to record on the PlayStation 4 with Share Factor or whatever without using some outside tools. There you go. For people who want to share Yoke Watch 4 on the PS4. So there is that up to done. I've been talking about this. What's what the advantage for the PlayStation 4 versus the Switch and vice versa? Again, portability or versus trophies and able to record your video without using any outside material. Who knows? Is it even going to come out of Japan? Again, who knows? So, yeah, that is interesting. That's the reason why what that video is all about. Because it is a surprise that in Japan, Yokai Watch is becoming less popular. Pokemon still holds a bit there, but of course, like I said, there have been a lot of controversy about it, national deck thing. But we'll wait and see. Because a lot of people also criticize Pokemon that. There's not a lot of new features in it, it's just like, oh, new Pokemon, the originality is just diminishing. Oh, now you're too lazy to put in the national deck, but you can put all the 1,000 plus Pokemon in there. Uh, let's just say that both Level 5 and Game Freaks and Pokemon Company, they've been doing this for a long time. They're probably getting tired and fatigued. I don't know, maybe just me. <laughs> so there you go, that's the video it's all about. We'll have to wait and see the future of this yokai watch there so i'll see you guys later